In this video, I'm going to show you how to disable the Camtasia add-in in PowerPoint. First thing to do, launch PowerPoint. So from our start menu, and by the way, this works in a Windows 10 and Windows 11, I'm using Windows 11 at the moment. But I'll launch PowerPoint. So it's PowerPoint, I'll create a blank presentation. And we can see that Camtasia PowerPoint add-in has, has come up here. I've got show tip again or whatever. Anyway, I'll just close this down. So I've got this here, which is the Camtasia add-in. I don't want to use this, okay? I have no use for it. I'm sure it's a very good tool, but I don't want to use it. So let me show you how to disable it. What you need to do in PowerPoint, and it will vary depending on the version, but you should be looking for the same kind of functions. You need to go to File, and then go to options. So you might be clicking on the Microsoft symbol to start off with, but either way, you need to get to this bit where it says options. So you click on options, and then you need to wait for the options menu to come up. So the PowerPoint options has opened. What you need to do on the left hand side, go to add-ins. And then you'll see listed Camtasia add-in. Now this is the thing that we want to disable. The way to do it, down the bottom, where you've got manage, make sure you're on com add-ins and then click go. A new menu appears and you can see that Camtasia add-in is ticked. So untick that, press OK. What I'll do now, just close that down. I'm going to launch PowerPoint again. Click on blank presentation. You can see this time the Camtasia add-in has not appeared. On a separate note, if you use Articulate Storyline, which is an e-learning tool, and if you import PowerPoints into Articulate Storyline, I've always had an error when the Camtasia add-in has been on PowerPoints. So I've always had to disable it. It's a completely separate note to what I'm showing you, but just something to be aware of if you use Articulate Storyline for creating e-learning tools, and you're using Camtasia, and you're using PowerPoint, that that might be a problem for you. Anyway, you now have the solution. Hopefully you found this video useful. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more top tech tips.